But we start this noon with our story our Call 6 investigators broke just an hour ago. A crackdown on tax cheats. People hoping to steal your tax refund have been caught in the act. Call 6 investigator Rafael Sanchez broke the story on Twitter and now has the only reaction from the top tax man of the state. And the tax man says criminal charges could be coming soon, Mark. So let this sink in. The state says 619 people were hoping to collect $1.2 million of your refunds, and now they won't be getting a penny. The Department of Revenue tells me those 619 people were involved in identity theft or tax fraud, all identified in the last month by a new software program known as LexisNexis. It cross-references all the returns filed electronically and through paper. The state began processing returns on January the 31st, and in a month's time, a month's time, the agency uncovered a significant amount of fraud. In the past, the state would have made the discovery many months later when people complained they had not received their refunds. We spoke to the Revenue Commissioner, Mike Alley, just minutes ago. We did expect to see these numbers, but I would say that it, it probably is even more so than what we had anticipated. We've had uh, you know, fraud checks and identity theft checks in place in the past, but we've substantially increased the capabilities and sophistication of the steps we're taking this year. And again, we're seeing the result of that. More of my exclusive one-on-one -on -one with the commissioner, Mr. Alley, tonight at 6. We'll explore who are the people behind the tax fraud. All 619 mark $1.2 million dollars. Isn't that something? You know, you try to have checks and balances here. So aren't thousands of people already being asked to verify their uh, identity online? Yeah. Well, another safety feature, about 28,800 Hoosiers are selected randomly to uh, verify their information. So they have to go online and say, yes, I, this is who I am. That will not in any way impact a refund. So if you go online and you do this quickly, you'll still get your refund within 14 days. If you file electronically, if you file by paper, it'll still take about 12 weeks. I'll have much more of this developing story tonight at 6. Nice to have that added safety measure. Right. Thank you, Rafael. We'll see you at, at 6 o'clock.